You're watching Outdoors Delmarva presented by Gateway Subaru. Higher standards. And sponsored by Shorts Marine. Everything but the water. Welcome back to Outdoors Del Marva. Now, as you may have seen on our Facebook page, we got a chance to hang out with Jimmy Charles at the Cinepunxent Rotting Gun Club in Berlin. And it turns out, he's not only a great country singer, but he's also a really good shot. Pull. Oh. Del Marva really is a unique place in the world. And For sure. you, you've been all over. Yeah. And you keep coming back. Is there anything that that makes you go, oh yeah, this is home? The people, my mom, <laughs> you know, um, it's uh, you know, my friends and just the the smell, you know. I mean you yeah, but when you talk about springtime, we're gonna get that smell real yeah. real quick. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not talking about the chicken farms. That reminds me of it too, but that's not I grew up down a, a, a dirt road past 12 chicken farms and if the wind was blowing the wrong way, oh, boy. My goodness. Woo! But no, that salt air smell, you know, because in Nashville they have lakes and you know, we go out on the lakes, we tie our boats up, you know, the Redneck Yacht Club, mm -hmm. like the Craig, uh, Craig Morgan song talks about. It's um, it's a lot of fun, but it's not the ocean, man. It's it's lake, it's just it's icky, kind of, you know, it's, it's not the ocean or the bay. And, uh, you know, the line in, in the, the song that talk, you know, across the Bay Bridge with the windows down, salt air blowing all around. It's not only the, the, uh, the big Bay Bridge that I'm talking about, it's the Bay Bridge of Route 50 too. Cause that has a smell to mm -hmm. it when you, when you go across and, and, or even the 90 bridge. And every time I come home, man, I roll those windows down and I'm like, I don't care how cold it is, you know, and, uh, let them, my, my wife yells, and she's like, the baby's sleeping, put the, I was like, just give me a second. Stick my... <laughs> and then, you know, I know I'm home. They probably don't have any thrashers out there in Tennessee. They don't, they definitely do not. It's all right, that's why everybody keeps coming back here. <laughs> um, and talk about, talk about growing up, because you, know, you said you had a duck blind in the back. Yeah. That's, that's some real outdoors right there. Yeah, so, um, my dad loved to hunt. Um, you, you, really only ducks though you know we shot clays when I was younger I loved doing that and um, but we built we grew up uh, grew up right on right near river run golf course on the St. Martin's Neck River and it's a beautiful beautiful area I was so fortunate to be able to grow up on the water you got a great blue herring out here every time you look out the, the window and um, my dad and his buddies and I helped too we built from scratch a, a duck blind and then we had um, we had a chalky chess, I call him. He was half pure chocolate, half pure chess beat. Bay Retriever, big dog, loved it. He would sit in the, sit in that duck uh, blind with us. And we'd wait for hours sometimes, you know, and we're being, and he just couldn't wait, you know, the whole time. And we, he was trained, we trained him. And it was really cool to watch how to train him. We had this uh, pad, we put a, like an empty shotgun shell in it. So it sounds like a gun and shoot it off the end of our dock. And you make them wait because you don't want the dog running out there while you're still shooting if you're shooting if one's kind of flapping right so then you say duck man he would just take off and like it's just like uh, those chess big uh the, the, the dog dog dog. yeah just like that man so i got to grow up with that and um and shoot ducks and it was always my my job to clean them which i didn't particularly <laughs> like like i had to take all yeah. the down and um and then my dad my dad was great great uh cook so um, he would always cook to have all kinds of marinade. He would marinate, you know, ducks for, for a couple of days and we'd eat them and uh, it was just a great pastime. Thanks for coming out and, uh, you know, putting some rounds down range with us today. Yeah, that was a lot of fun. Yeah, it's a good time. Anytime you can get out Let's here. Let's shoot a couple just, more, I'm ready. Right, let's do it. We certainly can't wait to hang out with Jimmy Charles again. Make sure you follow him on Facebook to stay up to date with his latest tour information and his music releases. Coming up after the break, we'll wrap up the show with your latest viewer photos when Outdoors Del Marva, presented by Gateway Subaru, returns. <laughs> 